Starring... Noah Porter. Magical blue acorns. With spoons. Just an average day, ready for work. La 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 la. What was that sound? Robert, I swear that was the front door in Valley Closet. I know your name is gonna sound weird, but trust me, just listen to what I have to say. Robert, don't get scared, don't be alarmed. I have come with three things to tell you. Trace. One, I'm you, Robert Mary and Miley LaVos. Two, there's no cure for herpes. Rebecca is dirty, that's all you need to know. And number three. There is a zombie apocalypse. Oh my god, zombie cat! Right. Robert. When you are 23, you're gonna pretend you're Batman. And you're gonna break your vocal cords. And you're gonna talk like Batman. Trust your life and <coughs> I'm not sure what just happened, but good thing I went all the way to Walmart to get this great value lime margarita drink mix with natural flavor, with other natural flavor, sugar free, low calorie, and non alcoholic. I also went to get the starter flip flops. Walmart's such a great place to be. You can meet people you know, get your groceries, and adopt a baby there. Oh, why is that dead guy that claims that he's me still dead there? <laughs> what, are you retarded or something? Oh my god! He's a zombie! I'm not gonna get out of here. Why is he so slow? Now I'm going to call for help. So what I'm wondering is, why did the future me come back in time to tell me that there's going to be a zombie apocalypse and there's no cure for herpes for only him to be bitten by my infected cat and make him turn into a zombie which will cause me to kill me and I'll just have to repeat over and over and over until what? Did I really have to kill my cat? Was she really a zombie? Or did I just fake that if that was really me and I just killed a man and I'm going to be arrested soon? I don't know. Here kitty 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 kitty! Here kitty kitty! There you are! Ooh!